There is a whole lot in the tech world that seems cool, quite like a transparent display. Whether we are talking about Robert Downey Jr.'s Iron Man's warning about him and destruction in his Iron Man suit mask, the rebel base on Hoth, or Tom Cruise whipping through evidence in Minority Report. There's been no shortage of sci-fi writers and dreamers who love the idea of working on a clear screen. So, like anything in Star Trek, they are a reality now. But how do they work? Well, the underlying technology that makes clear screen possible has actually been around for quite some time. Any flat panel LCD display features a layer of pixels, the supporting color filters and the electronics required to power them and it's all see-through or you'd never see the backlight through it. In fact, the transparent LCDs are notably shown off by Samsung in its smart window which works like a regular window in your home that can display weather, email, travel information and other useful stuff and can even act as a digital blind when you want to darken the room. But this concept only works because the sun provides backlighting during the day. At night, it needs to be lit from an artificial source powered by a solar battery or something. That is why transparent screens made from OLEDs are where a lot of excitement is because the diodes themselves can generate their own light from an electric current due to their chemistry. So they don't need to be attached to any backlighting which not only means that you can use them in dark environments but they can also be made super thin and flexible. Perfect for a transparent display. OLEDs can even be screen printed onto a plastic base or laid as a thin film making it super versatile technology. Well, you say it's super versatile, but what can we actually use this stuff for? Well, how about heads up displays or HUDs in both aircraft and cars? The current solution use projectors with poor viewing angles and a transparent HUD display could not only provide much better image quality but make important information like remaining fuel viewable no matter where the pilot or the driver is looking and even use augmented reality to overlay the names of street or landmarks onto a windshield or even help with safety information like overlaying the view from a blind spot camera or what about this, imagine if you had a transparent smartphone display that could work on both sides. Fujitsu has been working on just that thing, allowing users to grip and screen from both sides of the phone. And speaking of smartphones, researchers at Corning had developed a way to embed tiny sensors right into the surface of a glass display that can keep tabs on things like health information or ambient temperature without the need of additional hardware. And there are plenty of ways for transparent screens to enhance your shopping experience. This is one of the big ones that manufacturers are pushing. So for example, an iPad or a pair of Nikes is on sale and is kept inside a glass display that doubles as a clear screen, displaying the pricing information of the product, featuring other interactive elements a shopper can use, while still being able to look at the product itself. And as a security device. And if you're not in the market for expensive sneakers, we should be seeing this technology find its way into much more affordable options like vending machines. To tell you how much calories are in that bag of chips, there. There are a few kinks to be worked out like increasing the lifespan of OLEDs and improving the current 70% or so transparency of the showcase technology that exists today. So it doesn't look like you're looking at whatever is through a dirty window. But when that happens, I mean sky's the limit. I'm not much of a fashionista, but there's gonna be some fantastic wearable technology when this stuff hits the mainstream. So hope you liked the video, if you did hit that like button and also don't forget to subscribe.